Johnny now for the team. Yeah, that's where we are. One nineteen. Steven, come over here. Of course, there's very, very little I can say right now. I have to analyze this. Obviously, possibly we'll move for a new trial. Certainly we'll appeal. The absurdity of the number merely underscores the absurdity of the entire proceeding, where I've not been allowed to offer one single piece of evidence in defense, of which I have a lot. So I am quite confident when this case gets before a fair tribunal, it'll be reversed so quickly, it'll make your head spin, and the absurd number that just came in will help that, actually. Why did you choose not All to right, testify today? Why do you think it was unfair? We got these things behind the tribunal. Why do you think it was unfair? Because go I cannot go into the details. I didn't testify because the judge made it clear that if I made any mistake or did anything wrong, she was considering contempt, and this judge does have a reputation for putting people in jail, and I thought, honestly, it wouldn't do any good. Do you still believe that what you said about these two women in the wake of the 2020 election was do you, truthful? Do you still believe do you, these do you claims? Still believe I, have, I, I, have, I have no I doubt, I have no doubt that my comments were made and they were supportable and are supportable today. Still. I just did not have an opportunity to present the evidence that we offered, did you notice we were not allowed to put in one piece of evidence in defense? Do you also realize that liability is not based on any trial? Liability is based on her disagreement with me on discovery, which so is, ab which is absurd. Why didn't right. you take hey, we gotta because I, I believe the judge was threatening me with the strong possibility that I'd be held in contempt or that I'd even be put in jail. Did so it didn't, seem, it didn't seem like... It was going to do much to persuade anybody, and it could uh, give her what she seemed to be threatening. Did you believe the women's testimony? Do you have any regrets about that? That's all I have to say. I have, I have. Do you have any regrets about some of the I, comments I, I, that you received? Hey, we to I will, I will. Shh, 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 Do you have any worked. regrets about some of the comments that the women received? Well, of course, the comments they received I had nothing to do with. Those comments are abominable, they're deplorable, no uh, defense to it, but I receive comments like that every day, uh, different kinds of things. Uh, I've represented clients who have gotten that from the other side. This is a terrible part of our political system. Republicans, Democrats, liberals, and conservatives all get that. Uh, my comments weren't that, and I think that was also a very unfair part of it because my comments had no connection at all to those, there were thousands of things on the pre in the press about this, of which mine were a small amount. There's no way to say that my comments connected to that, but that's going to be part of what we'll get to litigate in a fair court. Thank you. Is that behavior Thank you, that everybody. you officially Thank condemn, you. sir? Thank you, guys. How Thank you. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, guys!